hi guys with another video today i'm going to show you how you can make a cctv or spy camera from your old mobile from your old smartphone you can use it as cctv or a spy cam there's a different ways but today i'm going to show you very easy way that everyone can easily um, can use it and we just need an old phone and nowadays sometimes we have some old phone that we don't use long time and we just keep it as a secondary phone the must to have android any version old version of course our most uh, 4 android 4 plus 5 6 7 8 or so any kind of android phone if you have it and you just install one app here just connect the internet at home at home and search it and you said there's a lot of apps come but here you have to use there's a two apps but this is different color uh, the thing is the monitor camera you have to see the monitor camera here and you can just click on it and install basically you need a two mobiles of course one is your personal mobile because we all have a personal mobile that one we will use as a monitor but this this mobile we will use as a camera only as a camera so you can use it anywhere so first you install this app here and accept it and now it's going to so meanwhile we go to our personal phone for example we have like personal phone here and here again we will just open the app store and click again at home exactly here and there again is a red app so here you can install the red app for your personal phone which one you want to uh, target mobile will be the blue and the red color will be stall as a monitor as you can watch it so this is how it's work so you have to stall different colors in the different mobile so here you can see the app red color stalling okay streamer security camera on the target app your old mobile should use and this one is the mobile which one you have in your hand and you want to target to watch the videos so what is you can open the both here the first you have to stall okay let's see okay here you can see your device may support hardware encoding and then okay switch switch to later so here you can see we get the code here we can get the code and username so what we do it we need a, this code to detect our mobile so we open here the red app at home okay and just click next next and click here yes accept and here is if you want to you have to register or you have to sign in if you don't register you can register from the Facebook or you can just write it here your email whatever the email I will write myself here so okay for example I write email here and I write the password you can choose any password it doesn't mean you should to choose exactly your email password you can choose any password to register the app and your email is going to register and you got the email you should to get the email on your uh, for activate let it be okay you can see here this screen shows here now and it says okay so now is demo we have to go me and here we have to go to the scan camera for example my camera add first streamer first streamer is looking for barcode so here we have barcode as you remember 
so here we go to the app uh, the app we downloaded here the blue one as you can see here the blue one and here we get the code let me refresh close all app for example sometime this thing gonna happen so you can just click on it here and okay and you get a code from here register QR code okay exactly here and this camera you will use it okay that's all and you can just close it like this now you can see this is online right and this camera this is your old phone and now you can just even close it right here it's closed right and then you can click it here play button so currently it can show you this is the back camera so now you can't see anything here's my hand okay now I will go to another side and I change the camera mode the camera side you can see here is the button to change the camera I click here and the camera change from here before it was a back camera and it should be yeah right here you can see right here exactly so now if this mobile to your friend or whoever your family member who you want to track down or you want to trace they don't know the phone is closed and you can see here I can choose the camera back or front from here you can choose it you see I click on the camera it going to change on the back camera okay okay now as you can see see and then for example if that's on the table so you can check choose the mode another camera and then right here so this is a very nice useful and if somebody will open it for example they will open it they don't know even the app is behind running and you can see here still it's working so it's a very useful app you can buy it for some extra feature for remove the ads but here you can see the camera is working and even nobody's know that some app is working on back so they just do their chat or something whatever they do they can just uh, do the browsing whatever but behind the camera is running so you can record here there's a many you can on the flash from here on the front side this mobile don't have flash but the back side for example the camera is now back side so you can see but I can on the flash from this mobile exactly right here and close it right here and close it I can know the battery percentage exactly on the screen so this is kind of spy mode so you're the people you targeted they don't know uh, they have mobile and actually somebody is spying on them and you can hear the voice you can see the recording and everything and another way as a CCTV is a very easy way I will show you now after this for example um, so guys here's the adopter what we do it just plug the adopter anywhere like this so this is the adopter the reason is the charging can finish so you get the mobile the, the mobile the, your old mobile or whatever the mobile you want to use as a spy cam or as a CCTV so this is the exactly mobile just now I show you you can take a tape so better you you have if you have the case is better because for the case you can make a double tape small double tape you can stick here like this you can take it the big one but I just want to put the small one here and just bring out like 
yeah exactly like this so the mobile we can stick somewhere near the door or wherever you want if you want to hide it someplace you can hide behind the bottle or whatever for example this is like plastic you can hide the mobile here and it's just like nobody gonna know and the front camera is come out so there's many things at home you can think yourself or if you want to make a, like a CCTV exactly so you can put it here exactly on the corner and for example here and you can just plug the power cable here so it will continue charge so what I'm going to do it now I will on it or even I didn't on it I the, the charger is connected here exactly so the mobile look like a closed right here and then what I'm going to do I will open my this this mobile here I will open the app at home and here you can see it's a standby mode so it's it's online here I'm going to change the camera because it's the back camera back side and now you can see right here you can see me here exactly so it's very nice CCTV and now you can close the lights even and you can see straight away my hand and even you can see my face here yay <laughs> so this is a very easy way you can record and it's like a CCTV it's like a CCTV and nobody will know the mobile is on but the, the, the doctor I put it here actually you can use it without cable also but the main thing the battery can be finished if normal you stick the battery can finish for far if you have like a 24 hour and you can just stick it so no problem because nobody gonna use it connected from your sim card so it's better but if you use at your home and it's like 24 hour and for non-stop you want to make it so you just better plug the charging so it will continue charge I hope you get my point so it's very good thing and now I can check both phones on the standby nothing is on all the time so whenever I want to use I will open my mobile here okay here's the app I will just click app wherever I am and I can see the CCTV footage here and there is a uh, uh, many options here I can record it here this is a record I can listen the voice there's a mic capture the quality and different kind of modes so here is the yeah and I can zoom it right here I can zoom it and now you can see me my hand more yeah it's the same thing I can stick it like like here now you can see me here okay this is a front camera because I'm using front camera you can see my face here so this is a CCTV now or spy camera and here is your mobile you can watch all the time so you don't have to buy very expensive CCTVs and pay a lot of money for software installation you can do your everything at your home hope you like the video and if you if you find it's very useful don't forget to thumbs up if you don't like it thumbs down take care see you in next video Bye bye. And one thing more I want to add uh, use a smaller phone, it's easier, it's lightweight, and it can fix anywhere. And if it will be a little bit big battery, it will be more better. But if you want to uh, spy someone, you don't have to plug the charge all the time, you can use a bigger battery. So, because nobody going to use the phone, you can connect with the Wi Fi it's if near around have Wi Fi, or you can put a SIM card and you can stick the phone and you can put some paper. Here, some paper or something so nobody can know and you this is just 
then you need to ha open only the small so you can hide actually all mobile you can hide all mobile but you need to open only small camera view like if you can make it so actually i can put some paper here all the paper or any kind of thing i can put in many different plastic cover or whatever in the shelf but i need to open in this camera lens so it will be the real spy and it will be like uh, nobody can know that 